In today's Marble Duel Special Edition, we have PewDiePie and T-Series taking the stage. This was one of the most requested duels here on m &H Racing, so let's hope it lives up to the hype. As always, I'm your host, Alex B, commentating the play-by-play -play for every m &H Marble Race. As you can see here, we have the same track used in our previous Marble Duel. And now approaching the track, looks like both of our competitors are ready to go. And with the starting gate release, they're off! Down into the first maze and into fall number one. PewDiePie getting a great lead. Ooh, and T-Series catching him up right there. And T-Series now looks at the slight lead. Ooh, and nice defense around T-Series, pushing PewDiePie right out of his way. T-Series making his way down the zigzag, down the ramp, and into fall number two. PewDiePie is still struggling to get down that first funnel, while T-Series has a pretty good lead in the first half of the race. PewDiePie going down that ramp and into funnel number two along with T-Series. T-Series still looking to have a good lead. PewDiePie looking for some openings. And what's this now? Looks like PewDiePie has the lead. He took it right away from T-Series and he's going to take it into funnel number three. Man, folks, what a comeback. He fell way behind the first half of the stretch, but he had the motivation to take it right from him. And there, T-Series failing to make a hit down in funnel number three. And PewDiePie just now skimming the edge of that funnel. T-Series almost finding an opening. Ooh, PewDiePie does exactly what T-Series did in funnel number one. And this gives him a good lead to the final stretch. The most important part of the race. T-Series struggling to make it down that funnel. And finally going down that ramp, down the spiral, and joining the final stretch. But unfortunately, PewDiePie is halfway through that funnel, and I think it's too late for him. He's still trying to find an opening though. And unfortunately, he was just too late to the party. PewDiePie finishes with a time of 1 minute and 35 seconds. T-Series struggling down these past two funnels. Man, has he fallen asleep? And finally, he makes it down that green path and finishes more than 10 seconds behind PewDiePie. Just like every Marble Duel, we got some great highlights to share. PewDiePie was in the lead right from the get-go, but T-Series gave him a nice surprise hit, and he was able to take the lead up until funnel number two. I have no idea what happened here, but man did it turn out well. T-Series had a great lead, he was just skimming the edge, and PewDiePie uses that opportunity to take the lead all the way down to the finish. And according to our predictions, it looks like PewDiePie will remain the king of YouTube. Which marbles do you want to see in our next duel? Post in the comments and you could be featured. Follow our social media down below for more MH Racing. And if you haven't already, subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss a race. And as always, I'm Alex B, signing off.